Billboard is a very popular tool among researchers and writers and being used since years for paraphrasing and rewriting any information in your own specific words. And this is not being used by young researchers but professionals are also relying on Killboard to save their time and energy. But with the evolution of AI tools in academic domain, the use of Killboard for paraphrasing or rephrasing is not safe anymore. Because when you use Killboard for rewriting, your document may get zero plagiarism on Turnitin, but it is now in a danger zone in AI detection report because your whole content which have been rewritten with the help of a Killboard is now coded with AI and being detected as a content which have been rephrased with the help of AI tool. There is no difference between the report of ChatGPT, Gemini or Google Bard and Killboard when you use these three tools for paraphrasing because these all are doing same and they are making your content as a AI paraphrased content. This specific video is going to show you some live proofs that how Killboard is destroying your content and how it is taking your content into the danger zone. To see that how Killboard is doing a disaster with your research document, let's see a proof on Turnitin before and after report. So this is our sample document and I am going to download this file and upload it at Turnitin and we will see the AI and plagiarism report before rephrasing this document through Killboard. According to the Turnitin report, our document have 2% plagiarism and 0% AI detection. Now let's run this document at Killboard and to remove this plagiarism or just to paraphrase which we mostly do with the help of Killboard to make it more academic and to increase or improve the tone of our document. This is our document and we will copy it and paste it at Killboard. At the moment I am using paid version of the Killboard so I can paraphrase more than 225 words which are mostly allowed in the free version of paraphrasing and I can check the tone academic form or anyone to make it more academic or creative or even I can expand with the help of a keyboard. So all of the 21 sentences have been paraphrased with the help of a keyboard. I'm just going to copy it and paste it in the document and now this document have been rewritten by Killboard and I'm going to save it and check it again through Turnitin and uh, I will name it a sample Killboard. Now this is the report which Turnitin have generated for me for the content which I have rewrite with the help of a killboard just to remove that 2% plagiarism. Uh, sometimes Turnitin take more time than usual to generate the plagiarism report and this is happening right now. We are not getting the plagiarism which report which was not the point of concern for this specific video. We are specifically focusing on the report of AI from the content which we rewrite with the help of a keyboard and you can see that just by single rephrasing with the help of a keyboard your whole document is coded with the AI content and now the Turnitin report is issued showing that your document is 100% AI written means you have rewrite your document with the help of any AI tool and when we explore this AI report we can see that either Turnitin is considering it as a rewritten content or originally written content from AI so as I told earlier that there are again two types of AI written content which Turnitin provide us one is AI generated only and the second one the text that has been AI generated or paraphrased with the AI as we used to, to Killboard to paraphrase our content and Killboard is integrated with the AI that's why Turnitin has detected uh, this content as a content which we paraphrased with the help of AI tool and that tool can either be chat GPT, Gemini or any free tool which you use to reform or re-establish the structure of your document and the same Killboard is doing with your document it's making your document 100% AI. So what is the best 
best choice for rephrasing and paraphrasing there is no best choice except learning by yourself or you can rely some AI removing tools because these tools are not only going to tackle with the plagiarism but they are also going to make your content human written content and among them AI humanizer Hicks bypass steelc.ai uncheck.ai are some important examples to see this type of a content and stay updated with the AI tools and all the innovations which are being held in the domain of research, don't forget to subscribe my channel and visit my website where, where you can leverage my paid content and trainings which helps you in your academic and research writing. For further insights, stay tuned. We'll see you in another very informative video. Till then, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.